In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to unlock an iCloud locked iPhone or iPad without using an Apple ID or passcode. Before we dive into the steps, it's essential to understand that unlocking an iCloud locked device can be extremely challenging, primarily because Apple restricts this process for security reasons. Typically, you would need the original Apple ID credentials to proceed. However, if you've lost access, there are still a couple of methods you might try. Let's explore them. First, let's discuss the account recovery option. Begin by opening your web browser and navigating to iforgot.apple.com. This is Apple's designated site for handling account recovery and related issues. Once you're there, you'll need to input the Apple ID associated with the locked device. After entering your Apple ID, follow the on-screen instructions carefully. The site will guide you through several steps meant to help reset your password or, in some cases, verify your identity to regain access to your device. While this approach can be effective, it relies heavily on having access to any associated recovery information or trusted devices. If successful, you'll be able to reset your credentials and unlock your device. Now let's move on to the next method, which involves contacting the original owner. This is particularly relevant if you acquired your device secondhand, such as buying it from a resale site or as a gift. In this scenario, the original owner can assist in removing the device from their account. You'll need to reach out to them and request their help. The original owner must visit iCloud.com and log in using their own Apple credentials. Once logged in, they should locate the section listing their devices. Here they can find the specific iPhone or iPad, select it and remove it from their account. Once this is done, the device will no longer be linked to their Apple ID, allowing you to set up your own. It's a straightforward process for the original owner, but requires their cooperation and access to their Apple account. In summary, while Apple has stringent security measures to protect devices, these methods give you potential pathways to unlock your device without using an Apple ID or passcode in specific circumstances. Always remember to proceed with caution and consider the legitimacy and legality of your actions. If all else fails, reaching out to Apple support for professional guidance is always a wise choice. Thank you for watching and I hope this video has provided you with the clarity needed to tackle this issue.